Greetings and salutations. My name is Tish and welcome to the Artist Haven where home plus art equals heart. In tonight's live video broadcast, it is Saturday Night Shenanigans. Woo! And you know what that means? That means you, the viewer, get to pick the colors that I use in my acrylic pour tonight. So, let's get started. And tonight, I have an 11 by 14 canvas, and I have a whole bunch of colors mixed up and ready to rock and roll. So let's see what we got going on. Woo. Okay, push the wrong button. Sorry, sorry, sorry. And you know what? Actually, what I was going to do is show you real quick last week's painting but i had to remember which one it was because yeah i kind of forget those things oh yeah hey it was that little eight by ten that we did we did a chain pull with the actual chain so let me put that link in the comments <clears throat> so if you have worked here last week put that in chat for y'all and if you weren't here last week then you can see what that is and i'm trying to find it here it is this turned out i think this turned out just absolutely smashing but because I tried to do a chain swipe with an actual chain. This is what I used. This is an actual chain. This guy right here. And it didn't turn out the way I thought it would. I thought I would swipe it a little bit better. But I think it still turned out really cool. Um, I like the orientation. Whoop. Sorry, my left hand is not deci has decided that it doesn't want to work today. So, but I think... This is still really cool, and I can't wait to um, do resin on it because the colors in this, the metallic green, and just all the cool colors that came through. And you guys last week did a phenomenal job picking out the colors, but I don't know if you can see that. That metallic orange is just kind of lame. So, yeah. Please don't buy the Artist Loft metallic orange unless you have something to add to it. To make it more, <clears throat> excuse me, metallic-y. Because it's not very metallic-y. But I still think it's really cool. It's got a lot of motion and movement to it. Yeah. It's rocking. And the cool, the, there's some really cool cells in there. I turned off the autofocus so I can't bring it up real close. Otherwise it gets all fuzzy. But it's got some really cool cells in it. And that's the orange that you see here. This is all orange. And I'm really kind of sad that it's not more metallic. I mean, there's a little bit, but not much. All right. So there's that. Woo. Tripping over my own chair. All right. So um, I'm going to use white as a base color because that's what I have mixed up. I can use black. I do have some black mixed ups in that container over there. But I mixed up some white as I was watching YouTube videos. And eating my supper that I couldn't make last night. I ended up last night after the flip cup with Brooke, which was awesome. Oh my God, she had such amazing painting, y'all. But um, I was going to make that, but I knew it was going to be an hour before it was ready. So I just went ahead and made some peanut butter and jelly sandwiches because that's my that's my go-to. So let's see who's in chat here tonight. I see Doris and Cheryl. Hello, hello. Welcome. And Brooke. Hello, Brooke. And Sally is here. And, Sh and Cynthia from My Fox's Baby Cakes. Hello, hello. And Monica. Welcome, Monica. So glad to see you. And Trey from Max World Entertainment. Hey, I need to message you back. I'm sorry. <laughs> I meant to. <laughs> 
I'm just not on Facebook really all that often anymore. I get distracted and I get into my mode and get into my music and I forget everything. Oh, thank you, love. My, yeah, that piece is drying really nice. I'm just like, oh, so excited, so excited for it. I will get back to you. In fact, after this live, I'm going to message you real quick. I still love you. Oh, I'm grateful that you love me because I love you too, honey. And thank you, Doris. Okay. Okay, you guys. We need to pick some colors here. Um, I'm thinking five. I always go for five. I've got a smaller canvas. It's only 11 by 14. So, and I don't really, I mean, I have a plan, but it depends on what colors you pick. Because I might bring out some old standbys. I might, you know, I don't know. I kind of have this idea in the back of my head. So it depends on which color you pick. Because I have a couple of ideas that I've been wanting to try. And it's kind of funny how my brain works. <laughs> so I'm a creative. My mind goes where it goes. So. <laughs> okay. Doris picks Prussian blue, which I got right here. Bam. <laughs> you know I'm always going to pick purple. Oh, hell yeah, because Cynthia, you and me are on the same wavelength, love. <clears throat> Metallic purple? You know what? I might have some. Hang on. Let me go get, a, let me go get my purple. Let's see. Dioxazine purple. And I'm trying to see if I have any metallic purple left. That's the Arteza. I haven't mixed up, you know what? We're gonna do two metallic purples. We're gonna do these two together. Cause I think we'll do two metallic purples and we're gonna kind of put them together and see what we get. This is the Dioxazine, Liquitex Basics Dioxazine Purple, which is my absolute favorite color in the whole universe. So <clears throat> let's see, what else do we got here? Fire engine red. Um, <clears throat> excuse me. I've got this cadmium red deep, which is a little bit deeper than fire engine red. But I don't have. Well, maybe I do. Hang on. Hold the show. That's the red orange. I do have a bright. This is a bright red. Look at that. So we'll put that one aside. We're gonna shake this up. I do love the cat this cadmium red deep. That is really deep, beautiful red. But we're gonna go with a bright fire engine red. This is the artist loft bright red that comes in the big bottles, like the artist loft white. So we're gonna go with that one because I I know I have more of that. And then I've got the dioxazine pur purple. Golly jeepers, I've got the hiccups. We're gonna take these two metallic purples and we're going to blend blend them together Golly. hang on i need to get a drink of water you guys got me all excited because i'm doing you guys are doing my favorite colors man blue and red and purple because blue and red make purple you know come on okay so we're going to tip this up we're going to let that drain in there <laughs> Yes, I did see you coming, Doris. Yes, gutter, gutter. Yes, always. You know me too well, Mr. Jason. Yes, thank you, Trey. Don't forget to share this stream. Thank you so much for sharing. I appreciate you. Hello, Marilyn. Awesome to see you. <laughs> teaspoon of sugar yeah i'm in my studio though <laughs> sugar's in the kitchen and that's a little bit of a trick okay so we're going to take the rest of this arteza which is on my wish list if anybody wants to help to the tish paint fund <laughs> I think it's on my wish list. You know what's really sad is I go through my wish list once a week and I try and find, make sure that all of them are still available. 
because Arteza and um, even some of the Liquitex stuff is is like selling out and it's like it's like no longer available and it's like come on Arteza what are you doing to me here but um, if it's not available as long as I think I think as long as you click on something on my wish list and you find something else from another seller I think it will still can be considered part of my wish list I'm not sure on that how that works though because I can't keep up y'all I mean, we're all sequestered to our houses, and so things are selling out really quick. And I appreciate all the things that I get. And it, I mean, it brightens my day to even just get a small package um, from people. I mean, I live by myself, and just to see the Amazon delivery guy. <laughs> Which him and I have become have become like on a first name basis because I get a package about once a week and it's some of it's stuff that I order that I need for like life, you know, like toilet paper and things like that. So it's just awesome to have people send me things too. I mean, if you guys knew how much love I felt from you all from sending me things. It would you guys would just be flabbergasted. I mean, I literally tear up every time I, I I get a package. It's like I feel the love, and I appreciate it so much. And I think I have my lighting down now. So Patreon is gonna hit it full bore next week. I know I've been saying that, and I'm bad for saying that, but. Okay, so we got one, two, three, four. We need one more. <laughs> Hello, Jay. Hello, bro. What's up, bro? <laughs> oh, it's so awesome to see you here. And Michelle, wonderful to see you. So grateful you could take time out of your day to spend it with us. I know everything Arteza is sold out. Everything. Oh, dude, I just got purple paint on my shirt. Um, everything that is deco art is sold out. And it's like, okay. So I'm also building, I'm building a wish list on Blix because I found out that Blix actually has been been able to get some of the supplies. Like the what is that paint that Johnny uses? Um, the chroma color, that metallic. I want to play with that, y'all. And, um, and it's not just the gold and the bronze and stuff, but they have like blue and red and all these really cool colors. Cause I love metallic. I love metallic on black. That is like my kryptonite y'all. So yeah. What? Oop. Two cans of UV archival. See, I can get that at Lowe's. I've been able to find that at Lowe's. I just, I need to go get some more. I just, I have a panic attack anytime I go out. I know I'm being I'm gonna be totally transparent here, y'all. I I went out today to go to Cub Foods because I need to get a couple of groceries like juice and my ramen, because that's pretty much what I've been living off of. Um, just because it's easy and it's quick and I can just be done. I don't have to cook a full meal. Although tonight I had well oh, chicken and zucchini and it was amazing. But um I went out for the first time in almost a week. So, yeah. Got two Michaels that I'm aware of. Both are pretty much empty. Yeah, everybody is empty. It's like, aw, thank you, Brooke. I love and appreciate you all. Let's see. What else? I need one more color, y'all. One can is almost empty with all the AI. Yeah, no kidding. Um, I'm looking. <laughs> I love you, Jay. You're awesome. Um, just what do you, do what you can and don't worry about the rest. We're just happy to spend time with you. Thank you so much, Cheryl. I appreciate you. <clears throat> I 
And, I, you know, I appreciate whenever anybody can have time out of their day to spend time with us. Because, you know, it's I always say it's not my channel. It's our channel. Yes, I'm kind of the, you know, you know, queen of mischief here. But I think of you as all as my equals. And I, I love each and every one of you. I appreciate you so much. Rainbow Loom Projects. Wow, that sounds actually very interesting. I know, metallics on black. I mean, I'm so showing my goth side, okay? I'm showing my metal girl. <laughs> Let's have a kryptonite night. Yeah, yeah. Light blue or medium blue. Okay. Let's do this. Let's do this ultramarine blue. Because I think I think last night's painting, this and the ultramarine blue kind of blended together and made this really cool blue that I really loved. And I want to show you, but you guys got to be here next week on Friday Night Flip Cup when Brooke comes on with me again. And I will show you the painting from last night because, oh, my God, it is so, oh, my God. I'm like, I don't know if I want to sell that one. Aw. Yes, metal girl. Raw, raw, raw. Hello, Sue. I actually just got your email and I'm going to respond to you because I would love to have you on the Art of Palooza. God, I'm so excited. Are you kidding me? It'll be the first international Art of Palooza. That'll be amazing. Oh my God, I'd be so, I'm so excited for that. I'm just like so excited. Okay, so we got our five here. And what we're going to do. I don't have enough for the Frisbee. But I do have enough, I think. Hang on. I'm trying to find it. Don't mind me. Where are my little thingamabobs? <laughs> Excuse me. Where are my little thingamabobs? You don't know what I'm talking about. There they are. Okay. We are going to do, we are going to take, golly, now I can't think of her name. What is her name? Oh, my God. I'm so awful. I'm awful with names. Okay, I'm going to warn you now. I'm awful with names. Um, Because who's the girl that does, the lady that does, that's overseas? Okay, I'm in the States, and she's overseas over, like, in, in, but she does all the really cool bloom pour, the really cool bottle bottle bottom pours, and then she does the res reverse dip on them. That's what we're gonna do tonight. Cause I got a hair. We're, I've got a black canvas, but we're gonna do we're gonna do white. I'm trying to decide: should I lay the white down first and then put this down, or should I just do it on the black and see what happens? Fiona, thank you. Golly jeepers. I can hear her voice in my head. I could see her cute little face. I could not think of her name. Yes, Fiona. Yes, yes, yes. Yes, yes, yes. Thank you all for having my back. Yay, Brenda is here. Hello, Brenda. So, yes, Fiona is in Sylvania. She is so a freaking adorable. I love her. I watch all her lives. I don't necessarily go into the chat, but I definitely listen to her chat. And she's... <laughs> That's funny. <laughs> yeah, you don't know who... If you don't know who she is, you need to go find her. I can't remember her channel name right off the top of my head. I can't even remember her real name. I just hear her voice in my head, and she's so adorable. And she does such beautiful art. And I just love her. But... um. Yeah, hello from Sylvania. She's so adorable. I just love it. I'm still getting my learn on here. Yep, absolutely, Trey. We get it. We get it. We all have to start from zero, whether you're doing an art, whether you're doing a YouTube channel or learning a new craft, you all start from zero. So, hey, we love you. No worries. Okay, so what do you think? Should I lay down the white first? 
I know she's an awesome human and artist. I know she's just so, she's just so awesome. And <clears throat> I watched um, Heather Major's live last night after I got done cleaning up from mine, but I missed her fractals. So I've been meaning to go back and watch it, but I've been, I've been trying to catch up on all of your guys' content, you know, Clara's content and, and Chris from Desert Pours and, and just everybody i try to catch up on everybody while i'm eating supper and stuff so it's just amazing yep exactly it cheryl we're all trying to get our learn on where do i sell my stuff that's a funny question you ask um i'm actually in the process of building a website and it's not only for me but it's gonna be for me and my art and my furniture and all the other stuff that i make as well as other artists that don't have an online presence and don't want to do Etsy or eBay or build their don't have time to build their own website. So we're going to have my page and they're going to each have their own page. And then we're going to have another page that's going to be like Elisa and Clara and Doris and all the people that have their own page or their Etsy page. We're going to have links to all of them. We're going to have links to Amazon so when they have it in stock you can actually buy it it's just going to be a cumulation of is it accumulation 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 yes <laughs> sorry my verbiage is just off today i guess but um of all the artists that we have of all the supplies that we use we'll have links to um to the resin store we'll have links to um to stone coat we'll have links to all the supplies that we use here on the channel and people you know that link like clara comes on and she uses certain things and elisa comes on and she uses certain things we're going to have all of that gathered here on the website unfortunately i am not a computer guru and it's taking me a long time to build all this stuff but it is in the process and i'm hoping praying to the internet gods and any other god that'll listen to me that i'll have this done by middle of next week i'm hoping to have it done by artapalooza i've been working on it a little bit every day in segments so we're gonna see but if you're interested in a painting that i do on a live stream just message me on Facebook and I'll set it aside for you. I'll finish it how you want and we'll work out a price. So um, that's kind of how I've been rolling. Okay. Now that I'm done with my battling. <laughs> potato, potato. Okay, where was I? Oh, that would be so sweet. Trying to catch up on content. It's so many amazing. Yes. And it's not even people that are part of our tribe. I mean, people like, I love Roberto Blake. I absolutely love him. And he has helped guide me and Andrew Can and TubeBuddy and VidIQ and just all these people, Daniel Batal and just, you know, just so many people. I know it's so exciting. I'm so excited. Yes, I, I, I'm looking forward to doing, you know, when they lift, because so many states have so many guidelines now. I'm waiting for some of that to be lessened because I want to do a gathering here. So, yeah. <laughs> yes, Brooke. I still love you. I still love you. Just to let the cat out of the bag, Brooke is one of the ones that doesn't have a website presence. And so I am giving her a website presence because I love her and I love her. Excuse me. God dang it. I got the hiccups. I love her and I love her art and I want her to have a presence because she needs to have one. And she is simply amazing as a human being, as an artist, as a mother, as a wife. She's just amazing. She floors me every day. <laughs> babble, babble. <laughs> uh, 
I love you too. You know, here's the thing. I watched, there's one artist that I've been watching for probably close to five or six years, and they haven't posted content on YouTube in that long. And I still, I still find their content valuable because it inspires me. And that is what I hope to do with my YouTube channel is maybe have you walk away feeling loved, being inspired, being motivated. You know, that is what I hope for my channel. All right, y'all. I need some. Qu I I need to know. <laughs> Daniel Vital is amazing. I love that man. Like uh, I want to squeeze his neck. Like really. Like in a hug kind of way, not like the other kind of way. Because he doesn't realize it. <laughs> tribbles. Yes, tribbles. Um. Daniel Vital has been, I'm part of his membership group and he has a thing on Facebook and I never post on there because all these people are so amazing and so wonderful and are just killing it. And here's me struggling to make a thumbnail. So when I'm ready, I will broach my questions and everything. So there's some things going on in the back and in, in, in behind the scenes here. Um, and I'm all about you guys, though. Really, truly. I I, I mean, I want to hit my 500 subscribers. I want to hit my 1,000 subscribers. I want to hit my milestones because I want to bring you better things. I want to bring you, I want to get to 1,000 subscribers so I have a community channel so I can bring you all the things. Bring it to you guys. Because the Facebook group is growing and I love it. I'm grateful for it. But I want to grow on YouTube, and to grow on YouTube, you need to focus on YouTube. And I really wish that it would give me a community tab so I can share so many more things. But, or stories. I would do a story every day. I really would, because I love you guys, and I want you to know what's going on. Okay, so I need to know. Tell me, do you think I should put white down first, or should I just leave it black and we'll see what happens? Thank you, Trey. I love you guys, too. Love you, love you, love you. Like, really, truly, honestly, truly, you guys are the reason why I get up in the morning, okay? I get up, and I and I motivate, and I learn, and I do these things that give me a migraine, <laughs> like a website. I am not a tech guru. I do not know these things. So... Okay, so we have, let's see, black background, see what happens, leave it black. Jay says white, Michelle says leave it happen. Oh, did Evelyn join us and I missed it? Hello, Evelyn, yay, Evelyn's here, ta-da, yay, I'm so excited. Aw, I'm so grateful that you come on and be your awesome self. I'm so grateful that you're all here. Okay, hold on. So we're going to leave this. <laughs> you're okay, Brookie Brook. <laughs> hey, if anybody knows how to build a website, y'all need to help me out because this girl's dumb. I'm trying to use Shopify. But it's frustrating me. Okay, so we're going to put a little bit of white down. And I am not very good at these. And see, I made these little things. So here's me being all fancy. I made these things with a little handle so I could pick it up. Okay. <laughs> it's just a little push pin with some, some glue. And you know what? There's a whole video on how I made these like eons ago. So I can eyeball usually pretty good. And we're going to kind of go like this. And I'm going to dump a little white on here. Just like that. Whoa. Okay, we got more than a little white. Okay. That looks about even. Okay, this is just basic... Um, 
Artist Loft White. Okay. And then we're going to do the Prussian Blue. Let's see if I can be a little bit more accurate with my flowage here. There's that. That looks pretty even. I say pretty even. But you know, the thing about nature is nothing is exact. Okay, let's use this fire engine red. <laughs> Michelle. <laughs> yeah, it's been a long time for me too. I did... I did do my Shopify site before, but I have a different plan now. So, <laughs> techno nothing. Sorry, Tish. Yeah, I appreciate you. I really do. All right, let's shake this baby up. Shake it, shake it, shake it like a Polaroid picture. Sorry, I'm probably showing my age. Although that's not that old of a song, really. Okay, let's see where we're at. A little bit right there. Don't mind my hair. <laughs> I washed my hair. I have this thing because now my hair is really short and I wash my hair. And then I... <laughs> and then I just put it in this like little tiny ponytail and then I decide, oh, hey, I got to go run errands and then I got to try and make myself look presentable. I still, I still go out and cut offs and, and uh, paint covered clothing. Cause you know, who am I to, to try and impress somebody? That red was really thin. That really carried. Mine is probably not going to be as beautiful as Fiona's is. Because she does absolutely stunning work. I think we're pretty even there. Let's do a little bit on this one. Okay, so let's do a little bit of white right there, just a little tiny bit. There we go. Then we're going to do the purple. Like I said, this is my favorite purple. And you know what's funny is people know me. Even though they don't come to all my lives, they still know me and they know purple is my favorite color. So I I get a, I get some purple gifted to me and it's it's such a blessing. And I'm so grateful. Okay. I think we're good there. do a little bit more because I want a little bit down there okay <clears throat> oh I can get photo I Shopify will host all my photos they'll take care of all my taxes they'll take care of everything it's just getting it all set up the way I want it to set up and it's not set up all their templates are not the way I want them to be. So I got to learn how to do some coding and 
it's just, it's really frustrating. Ooh, copper would be nice. You know what? Let's do some copper. I've got this copper. Let's do some copper between, I mean, we're going to have two, actually, we'll do this copper a little bit more white. Actually, this copper, a little bit more of the Prussian blue. Dora still like that. And then we'll do the metallic purple. Just going to do a little bit. And then I got to bring down the plastic wrap. Oh, you guys, I forgot the plastic wrap. Oh, I suppose I could. No, I don't know if the napkins are big enough. I don't have any napkins. All I have are paper towels. I don't know. Let me know in the comments what you think, in the chat, what you think about bringing in a paper towel or should I use plastic wrap, even though the past, oh, there's not very much Prussian blue in there. Hmm. Let's do the red. Um, let me know in the comments what you think I should use to do the reverse dip. Because plastic wrap is the bane of my existence. Let's do a little bit of this red. Just a little bit. There we go. Oh, why does that one have to be so big? That's what she said, right? Okay. Now we're going to bring in... The metallic purple and some white. Here we go. Let's see how that looks. I might have to bring a little bit more in. There we go. Let that sit for a minute. Let me check on chat. <laughs> I love your littles, Brooke. That's awesome. My problem is my picks are 300 DPI and they're too big for some sites. No, nope, they're not too big for me. <laughs> That's what she said. <clears throat> I know, littles have the cutest questions. Good girl logic. And you know what? Here's the thing. You know what's funny is when my daughter, when I was pregnant with my oldest daughter, Ariana, I had, like, ultimate cravings for Thai egg rolls. And now she loves Chinese food. I think, I think, listen. Okay. So, what paper towel? Wax paper or parchment? I don't have... Do I have what? I don't have any wax paper. It's in the kitchen. I could go get it. Is there? I think she uses a wet napkin. <clears throat> exactly. You gotta love them. And her daughter is just adorable. I, lo I love her so much. It's like I've adopted her as my own. <laughs> She's eight going on 28. Yep, exactly. I was pregnant with my third. I said to my four-year-old son, I'm tired because I have a baby growing in my belly. He said, I'm tired too. I must have a baby growing in my belly too. <laughs> That's awesome. That's so awesome. Okay. So now that we're almost to the edge, I'm actually going to lift this up. Set that right there because that looks like a good place for it. I'm going to pour a little bit of white in the middle. Just like that. And then, oh, where's my skewer? There it is. Okay, so we're going to bring this in like this.
Okay. I'm going to bring this out. Dang it! Stupid hiccups. I I find I I find I hold my breath more often when I'm on the lives with you guys than I do any other time. Okay. Peaches, and that was a year peach crops failed. Oh no! <laughs> Am I going to torch it? Not till I'm done. <laughs> We're going to all call our kids, right? Okay, so you know what? We're going to do, hang on. Let me bring out a paper towel. And I think, see, here's the thing. I don't think this is going to be big enough. So, I hate plastic wrap. Like, it's the bane of my existence. But, it should be wide enough to cover the whole thing. This is just cheap, cheap dollar store plastic wrap because I'm that girl. Okay, wait a minute. Hey! Whoa, okay. Almost dropped it. Okay. So we're going to do. Oh, I got paint on it. Let's flip it over. Okay. So we're doing the plastic wrap. We're going to do the pat, pat, pat thing. Okay, <laughs> I need Brooke. <laughs> I need your vibe, Brooke, because you do the most amazing reverse dips ever. Okay. Whew. <laughs> Thank you so much. <laughs> I got this. I got it. <laughs> As we all, I know. I'm like forgetting to read. Okay. So I need a drink of water. Hang on. Because <laughs> I'm like hyperventriloquating here. <laughs> okay. Anticipation, I know. I have been living my last few days in anticipation. Okay. So we're going to bring this up. like this and like that bam I'm gonna torch this 
and I'm going to call this good because I like actually hang on we're going to push this real quick we're going to take this and we're going to take this little bit and we're going to swirl it just that little bit Just, it kind of looks like the center of a yin-yang now, and I like that. So, what do you think, guys and gals? I think it turned out pretty awesome, but hey, I'll be interested to see how it dries. I'm just wondering if I, because there is a ridge, I'm wondering if it'll plane out. Or if there's going to be a ridge there. I don't know. We'll figure it out when it dries. But let's see how close I can get it without it going all crazy. Look at this. Just, I have never had a reverse step turn out like this, y'all. Y'all are my lucky charms. <laughs> And I'm not talking about the cereal, although the cereal does sound kind of good because I've been craving marshmallows, y'all. Like I used to eat when I was on my diet, I used to eat a handful of, of miniature marshmallows. That was my, my treat every night because there's no fat and they're fairly low calorie. Yep. I'm loving that. All right. So we're just going to let it sit there. We're going to let it chill and join us next week for Saturday Night Shenanigans where you guys get to pick the colors. And you guys always, I'm serious, y'all. There has been, there is yet to be a Saturday Night Shenanigans where it was a hot mess. Because look at all this. This is just, oh my God, y'all. Dude. <laughs> and as Doris knows, and anybody who talks to me knows, I call everybody dude. It's like, it's like a universal, unsexual kind of thing. Like, I call girls dude. I call boys dude. I call people that don't gender identify dude. Everybody's dude. And dude, this is freaking awesome. This is like the best I've ever done. And I have you to thank. I really do. And Fiona. Because I've been watching a lot of her stuff. And I'm like, okay. I can do this. I can do this. So. Yeah, it's copper. It's that, it's that, um, this is the copper that I use. And I'm actually, I'm actually going to go buy some more of this unless I can find it online. But it's the Art of Mines copper, y'all, mixed with Floetrol, uh, 50-50. And it gives just the most amazing cells. And I'm like, I don't, usually I'm like all about, all about this uh, extreme sheen stuff. But I tell you what, this stuff is pretty amazing. Every painting has just given me these phenomenal cells. And I'm just, I'm kind of sad that it's almost gone. <laughs> but that, that jug has lasted me like six months. So I'm just, yeah, flabbergasted so much but i will be back on monday and we're going to do some experiments because brooke kind of planted a seed in me well not in a weird way y'all but um i've been wanting to try micas in some base in some um in some mediums and try and do pours with them and so monday's experimentation day and I will be live at 3.30 p.m. Central Time because I'm in Minnesota. If you can't tell by the accent, don't you know? Um, and we're going to experiment with that. So join me Monday. I'll be setting up those lives tomorrow morning. I'm going to set up the whole week, I hope. Um, and we will get down to it and do some experiments and just have some fun and chit-chat and you know, like we always do. We always have so much fun on this channel. And I'm so grateful for that. I'm so grateful for you. Thank you so much for joining me tonight. I appreciate you so very much.
I have no words. And for me to not have words, that is a miracle. I appreciate you. Thank you so much for joining me. Remember, be kind to one another. Peace, love, and happiness. Peace, love, and happiness, y'all. Ha, ha, ha.